Hey guys, Ali Crunch here. We're back with How I Met Your Mother, episode 11. So we had the Storm episode. This episode, we probably had two of the funniest episodes and one of the funniest episodes and mixed emotion episodes of the show. There was so much emotional damage. There was so much. Oh, the Robin Barney. Uh, I'm very curious to see how they're going to keep going with that. Um, no, I really enjoyed it. I think like the, the, the Ted thing, Ted and Marshall thing killed me. Uh, just absolutely seeing Barney's face when Robin didn't go through with it. I'm curious to see how that Kevin's gonna, how the Kevin Robin relationship's gonna end. And yeah, I've been waiting forward to look forward to jumping into this. So guys, we're gonna go into it. So guys, if you enjoyed the action, make sure to leave a like, subscribe. Make sure to this bad boy. Then he broke up with his girlfriend for Robin. Then Robin chose Kevin over him. Oh, don't remind me. In a bad place. Hey, you all right? Why wouldn't I be all right? Barney's single again. It's what America's been clamoring for. Oh, you just went through a breakup. The vibe's a bit different this time. Usually when people do something crazy. Last time he went single again, he's sleeping around straight away. I don't even like him anymore. Based on all the stuff you've done to them over the years, I'm not sure you ever liked them. <laughs> I'm serious. Come on. Zoe, Victoria, the slutty pumpkin. Now I'm worried you're going to do something crazy. I'm not going to do something crazy. And he's going to do something crazy. And yes, I'm going to do something crazy too. <sighs> what the fuck are you two going to do? Girls, man. Girls. You know what would kick ass? Smooth be. I are gay, not Marshall. But if all three of us were gay, you'd pick me over Marshall, right? <laughs> if all three of us were gay, mm. girlfriend, we would all three of us have some fun. Damn right we would. <laughs> That's the true conversation you have with bros. <laughs> not gay. Not gay. <laughs> <laughs> I wish men could have children thinking about the whole wife and kids thing. Really? Minus the wife. You can always go it alone, like Mr. Drummond on different strokes. Yeah. Could you imagine a mini Barney Stinson running around? This little kid in this suit. Oh, God. Your limo and scoop up some kids. Mm, simpler times. I guess it's better to have someone in it with you anyway, you know? Lifetime I always love these random the conversations. It just shows friendship. The test of time is this one. The sacred bond of man and bro. Maybe we should start a family together. <laughs> <laughs> oh, fuck. That's not the crazy idea, is it? Just go splitsies on a kid with your best bro. I wouldn't have to choose between dating and having a family. Hell, I could bring the kids oh, you... on these bad boys right up high. <laughs> and you totally join in, right? Oh, they've had way too much to drink. No, 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 yeah, no, yeah. It's good we know where it is. Hey, guys. It's good that you know where it is. Just like that, Lily and Marshall were beginning a new chapter in their lives. Are they? Which meant only one thing for us. To get a child. A baby. Oh, for God's sake. <laughs> Hey, let's idiots. talk baby names. Barney. Oh my god, that was my first choice too. No, listen. You and I are drunk, which means there's a chance <laughs> that adopting a baby is okay. She's a rescue. Might not be a good idea. Yeah, You're just right. a bit. So let's go home, take some aspirin, drink lots of water, and then see if it's still a good idea tomorrow. That's a smart decision. Ah, oh, for fuck's idea. sake. <laughs> There is not. I stress this enough. Barney and I were going through a tough time. Yeah. <laughs> You're not leaving, and that's final. Look, it's more of a hobby. Excuse me. And now we're fighting. You know what? Forget I said anything. No, 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 no. And now we're, we're fighting. This discussion. <laughs> Architect is my life's work. Why don't you quit your job? I don't even know what it is you do for a living. No one what does. Is I do for a living. No one does. Work. Ted, 14 hours a day so that our baby can How do you see your friends? And a nice house while you Cobra. What? A kid needs a pet Cobra, Ted. Don't be a pill about this. And we'll have amazing What the fuck parties. is going on? What are they doing? <laughs> place is enormous. I mean, look around. <laughs> Fuck's sake. Possibility of <laughs> Daddy's home. There's no way they let this guy have a kid. Uh, Barney, wh uh, where did you get this baby? Please. Did you adopt it? Please. I have a guy. <laughs> you have a baby guy? <laughs> did Guy, the guy guy, get you a baby, baby guy? Baby guy? Where'd you get going? What? No, no, no. I'm not going anywhere with you. For He's just babysitting. Baby baby. Available, and we have a baby. Um, who is this little angel? Fuck off. Real quick, me and him, not gay, single, had a baby. We should look into having a sign made. Again, we were going through a difficult time. But this part was kind of fun. Yeah, okay. Yeah, okay, guys. 
This is. I am not coming out of this bathroom until everyone stops acting crazy. <laughs> That's the crazy no one. one. Being crazy again for the purposes of this story. Ken and I have a baby. <laughs> <laughs> I'm guessing it didn't actually. Sh <laughs> Guys, this is Hurricane Stinson Mosby. Mosby Stinson. You named your baby Hurricane. That is ultimately <laughs> inconsiderate. <laughs> the child got saved with that name. <laughs> okay, God. Who the hell does Barney have? Independent, non locking themselves in a bathroom on Thanksgiving, people I know. Why, why are you so upset about it? I don't know if Marsha is going to talk to her. Oh, Marsha is such a good boy. Is this. About more than us moving. This is good cheese. <laughs> Robin. You know, we hate girls. We wish we were gay. Just guy stuff. <laughs> and we kind of sort of decided to oh, adopt God, a baby. Uh, no. Then he probably also did not tell you that he was babysitting our new daughter. I thought he was. There we go. This is your daughter? Oh. We didn't do it. Because what she found with her husband and what I found with mine, it was worth the wait. Oh, mate, Barney's brother coming in with the advice. Cool name, isn't it? Isn't it? Tom <laughs> forgets. It gets pretty tough. No. I know it does, buddy. Give him a hug. Um, good. Because get this, Ted almost adopted a baby. Oh yeah, <laughs> he always Crazy, does right? that. <laughs> he's going through some stuff. He actually tried to rope me into it. Like, can you imagine me being someone's dad? I'm pregnant. Oh. What? <laughs> I wasn't. <laughs> I should have expected that. That's such a like Ross and Rachel story. <laughs> I didn't even cross my mind that he could go to a prison. Oh, that makes sense with the random. Oh, they just told him straight away. <laughs> Pretty much. Jeez. <laughs> For fuck's sake. Oh, that's complicating things. <laughs> oh, yeah. Kept, if, if it ends up being Barney's, there's no. Oh, God. Oh, what are they going to do with that? So, oh, God. I, just want to, I could want to jump in the next episode and just see how they're going to resolve that one. Jesus Christ. Oh, mate, we're just going to jump straight to the next one, guys. Let's jump into it. That's uh, interesting.